The following Patriot Profile is presented without commercial interruption by Smith & Wesson. There are those who walk amongst us with visible wounds and those that walk amongst us with, with wounds that can't be seen. I just thought that, you know, I just couldn't handle it or something. It was just literally like this change of behavior and this person that I've known, you know, since I was 19 years old, he was just different. It wasn't what he said or what he didn't say, it was his eyes. And I remember one time he came back and the look in his eyes and I was like, the monster came home with you. There's no comparison to what I did in the military in combat into the civilian life. It was the breakdown of the communication because his brain had, had gone through so much and it was just shutting down. It's been called a bunch of different things. Shell shock, you know, I mean, battle trauma, battle fatigue. Anybody who's been to combat is gonna have to work through something at some point. Let's talk about how we're gonna start addressing PTSD. Let's start talking about how we're gonna break stigmas and get the word out to our veterans. There's not a cure and you can live with it. You don't have to necessarily, you know, suffer every day or, you know, kind of let it consume you. We fought tooth and nail to get where we are. It wasn't like we woke up one day and it's like, well, I feel better. They put their self forward towards other people more than their selves sometimes. It takes a warrior to heal a warrior. It's our job now as warriors that have gotten out to give back to those that are leaving, to give back that don't know what to do or where to go next.